Hi, this is Gary and welcome to episode number 700 of MacMost Now. On today's episode, let me share with you a list of things that I believe all Mac users must do. So I thought a lot about what a list like this would look like. What items should all Mac users do? And I went through various different ideas and what it really came down to is the number one item was so important and so big that I decided that the list really should have only one item on it. So what is that item? Well it's simply backing up your Mac. It's so easy with Time Machine to make a backup of your hard drive and keep that backup current. But yet so many Mac users don't do it. And if you don't do it, your data is only in one place. It is so easy for you to lose your data through a hard drive failure, through an accidental deletion of a file, or having your Mac simply stolen or lost in some disaster. Now perhaps a lot of Mac users make the mistake of thinking because their machine was manufactured by Apple that it's better than PCs. But in fact, the hardware is basically the same. Matter of fact, look at this brand new iMac. The specs here, if you look at the bottom right, you'll see model number. That's the model number for the hard drive. The hard drive inside of a new iMac. Now do a quick search for that model number online and you'll see very easily that that's actually a hard drive manufactured by Seagate. A good hard drive manufacturer, but it's the same hard drives that could be found in a PC, could be found in a server, in even a cable box or satellite box. So if you believe a cheap PC bought at an electronics store can have a hard drive failure, you should believe that your Mac can also have a hard drive failure. They manufacture millions of these things and not everyone's perfect. And also, even if it doesn't have a failure, you could simply make a mistake, throw away a file you didn't mean to, or if you have a laptop, and most Mac users do, simply have it stolen from you and then all your data is gone. Think of the photos on your hard drive. Think of the documents. Think of the items from work, the items from home, the lists you've created, the emails that you've saved, anything else that you've got on your hard drive. Imagine if it was all just instantly gone. Now this isn't the sort of problem you can solve after the problem occurs. You have to think ahead and you have to start backing up now. You can go the route of having a time capsule set up in your house and having laptops backing up to it wirelessly. Or if you're on a budget you can simply have an external USB hard drive. Just a quick search online for external USB hard drives it comes up with all sorts of buying options. You can get them from well-known sites, from Amazon. Uh, you can get one terabyte drives for under $100. I recommend for best results getting a hard drive that's twice the size of the amount of data you have stored in your hard drive. So if you have about 500 gigs of stuff on your hard drive, get a one terabyte drive. If you have a terabyte of stuff, get a two terabyte drive. Then all you need to do is hook up the drive go to your system preferences into Time Machine and turn Time Machine on. and It will walk you through setting up that hard drive as your Time Machine backup and you've got it going. The first backup is going to take a while so let it run overnight and after that leave that drive plugged in and quietly, silently in the background it will back up all your files over time and you'll have a complete archive of everything kept up to date within the last hour. It's a type of process that you set up and then you can forget about it. And if you have a laptop and you're using an external USB drive, just make sure at some point during the day or every couple days you plug in the USB drive and it will automatically recognize that it's your time machine drive and do a backup. So this is my one item list of things that every Mac user should do. Don't fool yourself into thinking it can't happen to you. Don't wait till next week, don't wait till next month. Get an external hard drive, start backing up. It's a smart thing to do no matter what brand of computer you use. Till next time, this is Gary with MacMost Now. Want more video tutorials? Just go to MacMost.com, click on the videos link at the top of the page, and then you can view all of the hundreds of MacMost videos by category.